Hi there, Seth here from macOS10screencast.com. This is my review about uh, Delibar. Delibar is basically a delicious and beautiful, delicious application for the Macintosh. You can get this hot application at delibarapp.com where you can even try out this application. Just click on Try Me on the website and the little preview shows actually the interface of Delibar. But I've already opened this application. The application sits in your menu bar as well as in your dock. Just click on the menu bar icon to bring up the Deli bar um, list. You see both windows actually look the same, but I will remove the Try Me preview on the Shiny Frog website. Okay, Deli bar again on the menu bar. In the menu bar again, you can see what Delibar is able to do for you. And here you can go to the preferences. This is where you can add your, all your delicious accounts. In the general section, you can set Delibar to launch when you're logging in to your computer. You can set a special hotkey for Delibar in the hotkey section. In my case, this is Control F11. This hotkey brings up Delibar whenever you press this hotkey. And I do this right now. In the Delibar menu, you can search all your delicious links. Just enter some keywords here like Coco and or my name. You see that my name is not listed in my delicious uh, bookmarks. Let's search for SAE. This is the school I'm working for. In the list, we can now view all the bookmarks that have this tag assigned. We can view our recent bookmarks we have added to our delicious list. We can view our network, where we can view all our friends' bookmarks they have sent us. In the saved section, we have nothing yet, but we can add saved searches there, like when we search for Coco and, let's say, um, iPhone development. I then just click on this disk symbol on the lower right, uh, provide a name for my new list, click save, and when we switch back to saved again, we see now a count of our bo bookmarks in this list, and when I click on that list, you see that this search is being brought up again in the daily bar, menu bar, and you can even detach this list, which makes the window now draggable across your screen. And I have one use case for this. Let's assume I'd like to write a link list. I think this is nothing the uh, developer has meant to do with this application. And I just enter some text now, and I can now e drag my links to the text my text field where I can uh, put together my link list. And I think this is a great idea of uh, using the product. And uh, let's make this a little faster now. Okay, I have my link list now. I can put this on my blog or send, or send it via email to all my friends or, or colleagues. I think this is a, just great f uh, f what you can do with Daily Bar. You can re-edit bookmark entries by clicking the small eye icon, a new window appears where you can set the title, the URL, uh, notes and all the tags for your bookmark. We can add new tags to our bookmark, just click them on the right side or enter them into the text field. You can even view recommended or tags from your network or send them to your network by clicking the list on the right side. Just click on a tag and it will be automatically added to your bookmark. I will close this window now. Let's assume I'd like to send this bookmark to a service. I'd like to share it. I can share all bookmarks on Facebook and you can send this bookmark to Mars Edit. I can share it on Twitter. I can shorten the URL. I can share it via email or I can share it just on my delicious network. Let's cancel this action uh, for the moment, uh, close the window. I'd like to show you what other features Deli Bar has by going through the menu bar items. Here you see that all the sharing functions have a 
shortcut assigned to them. And now let's save a bookmark to our delicious account. I have installed a bookmarklet, which instantly sends a link to Delibar. Once clicked, the Delibar uh, add new bookmark window appears, where you can enter text for your bookmark. And when you're finished, just hit Command Return. A growl notification appears that the bookmark has been successfully added to your delicious uh, client. Now when we switch back to Delibar, enter Delibar as a search term and let's say we'd like to share this on Twitter. You see that the link has been automatically shortened by Delibar, then enter the text for your tweet and then just hit return again to send it straight to Twitter. Then again, a growl notification appears telling us that the link has been automatically shared on Twitter. I hope you like this application a lot. This was it for the screencast. I'm done. I'm through with this screencast. Um, I think Delibar is just a beautiful, delicious client and easy to use. And if you'd like to be one of three lucky winners of a license, just go to our website, tell us what's your most favorite feature in Delibar, and I'm looking forward to see you in the future. Bye.